yesterday I was like, um, I, have you seen it? Did you watch it? I had to watch it again just to, just to get the whole view on the episode. But yeah, I, I got it. I did watch it. Yeah. Ye- yes, there's a uh, episode of, you know, of Chalmers was actually really, really fun for me. I was it like, was. what? Because they give us, they give us something that we didn't expect. No. So, um, le- let's talk about, um, uh, Zaria. You know, we, we have mm. always, I have always, I have always felt that, you know, Zaria was, you know, that you know, due to her dressing and everything, her wearing black, every time I've always assumed that maybe she's going that she's going to be the major problem that the witches are going to have, that she is going to be like you know a dark witch, mm-hmm. like them saying that uh, uh, Senna is a beacon for dark magic and all those kind of stuff. I was like. I don't think is that's going to be an issue because since Zaria is there and she haven't gotten her powers and she keeps leading them, she keeps falling for the dark magics and stuff, that she's going to be a huge problem. But anyway, she surprised she surprised us all by you know fighting back and freeing and freeing her and um, Senna from the dark room. So what do you think about that? Uh wow. Uh, I mean, well, I never thought she would be the, oh, uh, like the the person behind all the dark magic. I mean, let's just be fair. Her personality, yes, is dark, but like, I feel like she was just doing. I feel like, uh, we think she had she had dark magic mainly just because she never she was upset that she never had it, uh, got any powers. So, yeah, I'd say, uh, I, I really didn't think that Zara would be, like, the bad, the bad guy behind all of this, to be fair. Mm-hmm. True, true, but, um, uh, anyway, I wouldn't say much, I wouldn't say much, I wouldn't go, go more deep in, into that, because, uh, she, she surprised me, she surprised me to by you know by fighting by fighting back and something that we didn't expect i didn't i i had no idea that was going to happen was uh who the unsealy actually really is you know yeah, it's a surprise it, it, it's a surprise to it's a surprise to a lot of fans it's a surprise to a lot of fans mm-hmm. uh, that uh that winter was the unsealy because nobody nobody expected that i was i wasn't expecting that brad tv was just throwing us off throwing us all off and mm-hmm. we we couldn't figure figure that out she was the least of my suspects so what do you think uh, did you ever suspect that she was the one who is the unsealy absolutely not i did not suspect that at all uh me just because she was very very nice mm. but apparently but i guess um i guess some i guess sometimes you know like you don't really trust that trust the people who are, are like yes they may be like nice but you don't know if they're like really really nice uh it's like pretty much that um oh uh, uh, a saying that, that i've heard from someone by the words of don't trust anybody uh and well let's just be fair yeah it surprised me very very much like the like i never thought that winter would be the unseelie of all of anyone uh most people had like uh had suspicion it was like someone else but i never thought it would be winter so yeah that very that surprised me very very much Mm. Mm. truly truly that's that surprise nobody nobody expected i couldn't have predicted that as well it's it surprised every one of us so but at at some point you know we all just have to admit it that way but we 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 are we suspected that it was that um it was going to be liam that liam was the unsealing definitely so because the way the way liam started liam was liam was the first suspect 
he was the main suspect of everything due to the way he acts uh the according to the show they never showed us anything uh concerning winter except that she took she took uh paris uh friend abby from her mm-hmm. yeah. yeah that was the only thing so we we didn't focus on that because we we felt like uh, it was a payback for what paris for what paris uh uh did to zaria mm-hmm. yeah so that 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 was so that was so fun it was so fun watching that so um, i don't know why brad keeps brad keeps uh cutting uh senna and jordan's kiss yeah i know i know i did see the the part where they're about to kiss and then someone interrupted them <laughs> you know it, it's uh i was it's brad tv of course they would do something like that but i don't know why they keep i don't know why they keep doing that i don't know i don't know we 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 all we all the whole fans ship them very very much that they want to see the both of them kiss so bad but brad tv doesn't Definitely. brad tv doesn't want to show us that so anyway um let's talk about um let's talk about pa- uh, paris finding out that you know senna and her friends are actually truly witches that was shocking when, when, when she found out when she found out that they were actually witches she was like oh my god i know you guys are weird but i didn't know this is she was like this is this is way beyond she was this she was like this is way beyond her she was really surprised and scared at some point because she she never she never knew that they were actually truly witches she thought that maybe it's just something a, a weird stuff that you know that they all do together she never <laughs> the funny part is uh the, the funny part was uh, at the ending when um uh, senna uh, stepped back and you know in order to protect her friends she had to go ahead and face uh the unsealy by herself she did uh a, a, her powers and added a shield on her friends and the look yeah. the <laughs> the look on on uh the look on paris face like that look was yeah. was something it was something else yeah it was something else so what do you think about that I love I love the fact that it's just when I heard the words of oh, the uh, uh, Paris that you know when Sienna used the shield, it was it was it was funny, but like the fact that um um the part where Zarya said that it was her fault, and then Sienna said no, it's my fault. I got I got her into this and to get her out. The fact that um. The fact that she was, she was brave. She's gonna be uh, uh, like brave enough to stop the, the unseely, is, it's, it's amazing. Like the fact that she cares that much about her friend, about her friends, and she doesn't like, she doesn't, you know, she does. That, that, that we all know that Sienna is one of the, one of the bravest people we've ever seen on the show. Yeah. And the fact that she she was going to do that to keep her to keep her friends safe from any harm that the unsealed is going to do to her, it it's just amazing to me. Mm. So yeah. Mm. Mm. Let's talk about the name the name of the episode. There there was no way I could have guessed that name, Bizarre Land. The name of the episode. Yeah. So I I uh last week I, I mean this week yeah last week I made a post uh on the Bright Universe we made a post on the Bright Universe and you know I I posted a uh, a picture a picture of um uh I posted a picture from from Chamas you know saying that uh, 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 we are trying to guess what the next what the name of the next episode would be and Brad TV commented and gave us a hint uh, he said uh, uh they said that the name of the se- uh, the name of the next episode had um had uh the name had uh, zaria's name in it and then uh the name of a location 
so i tried i tried guessing i tried guessing that I tried guessing that but there was no way i could have come up with bizarre land that was that was something that, i think i went for when, when i replied that yeah. comment i went for i think i've forgotten what i've forgotten what i went for where's my phone hold on uh let me okay okay so i i went for zaria in the dark room you know because they they <laughs> usually they, they 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 went into you know after uh the last episode uh, after episode six you know when uh zaria and senna disappeared into the dark room so brad tv was like uh hint the name of the episode has zaria's name in it and it's a location good luck figuring that out so i was like tough one but i'm an impact and i can do this let's see the name of the episode is zaria in the dark room so uh that was that was pretty close to me it was it was very close <laughs> so what do you think about the name i i so much i so love i so much love the name so what do you think about the name bizarre bizarre land bizarre land yeah i love how i love how um uh red tv they always do these things i know this ever since you know i started watch uh watching like their shows is i always love how some of the times the titles can always have a play on board but what else? any any thoughts any thoughts uh on you know any thoughts on college years i feel like uh chamas as chamas is coming to an end i think we have one episode left yeah i think yeah wow. i also next week is probably going to be their uh, season two finale yeah, yeah yeah it's going to be the season two finale so after that um chicken girl college years uh would be coming and i don't know uh but this this particular part now is for those of you who have been messaging messaging our bright universe um on uh, instagram and on even on facebook asking when is uh uh chicken girls is in 10 going to come out chicken girls is, uh chicken girls uh college years doesn't mean that it's the end of chicken girls there's still going to be a chicken girls season 10 but that will be after chicken girls the college years and chicken girls season 10 is coming it's coming next spring next spring so we're going to be seeing chicken girls season 10 so and don't ask me because i don't know uh who is going to be on who and who is going to be on colleges because a lot of i've, I've gotten a lot of questions popping in they were like some were even asking if tk is going to be back uh on on chicken girls but honestly i, I don't know i'm just as blind as everyone else right now <laughs> yeah oh my god so um that, that will be all because i want to keep i want to keep our review short i don't want it to be too too long i want to keep it short and stuff but Chamas Brad TV is doing such a great job with with Chamas, and I want to say a very big thank you to you as well for you know for joining for joining me right now. It's it's such it's such an honor. I saw the post you made. I saw the post you made uh, on Instagram. That was, was that yesterday or today? I think the which one is it? Was it was just the post of just me? Yeah, the post about you. You posted a picture about you and was like, you know. It was yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. So um, that was that was that was really cool. So welcome back. We hope to see more posts from you. Thanks. <laughs> all right. So uh, that that will be all. That will be all for for today. That will be all for today. So thank you so much for joining and also for for turning on your video. It's <laughs> it's cool. You look yeah. good, man. Oh, thank you, man. Ah. Same to you. All right, so thank you so much for joining. I'll see you later. I've got to be kidding me. Next time on Charmers. About time. Where's your posse? I'm the one you want. <laughs> it's just gonna be fun.